Hello y'all, I'm Nancy of Nancy's Notions and welcome to my channel. I'm a part-time reseller of pre-loved items. I sell on eBay, Etsy, Mercari, and Poshmark. I hope you enjoy these videos. I uh, will show you what I bought, what I sold, and how much I sold it for. Thanks for watching. Welcome back y'all, Nancy from Nancy's Notions and I've got another what sold clip for you. It is Tuesday, December the 12th and I have four orders, um, two on Poshmark, one on Macari, and one on eBay. And yes, I'm out here in my shed and it is cold, so I got my hood on. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm over cold weather already. <laughs> Let's take a look at what we sold today. Um, so first on eBay is the um, model rocket lot that I put together. Uh, funny thing, I woke up this morning and someone had sent me an offer I have it listed at 50, someone sent me an offer for 30. So I countered back at 40, and then like almost immediately, I got a notification that my $40 offer was declined, and then I got another notification that someone was offering me 45, a different person. I took that one. <laughs> um, so this sold for 45, where's my list? Came in a box, uh, had the rocket and some other things. Uh, and some paint. I sold the paint already, but the entire box cost $10. So I did $5 buy cost on this because I've done $5 buy cost on the paints. And then on Poshmark, we have this bundle deal. And these didn't come from Goodwill, but I'm reusing a Ziploc bag here. Um, these are three stainless uh, rings, and they're all skull rings. These were no cost. These are just some things that we had here. And then these two uh, Harley patches, which I got at a yard sale for 50 cents for the two of them. And this bundle together, uh, they offer, well, we went back and forth a few times and we settled on $30 for these three things. Our other Poshmark sale are these two wooden animal masks. I picked up four of them at a yard sale for $2. I sold the other two already, and then these sold for $22. And then our little uh, Indiana Glass Cat votive holder. This is Mercari sale. And this was from that store where I just paid $20 for, uh, I don't know, it must've been four things. Um, so I put $5 as my buy cost, which makes this look like bad buy. Uh, it only sold for 10, but the other things that I got, it, it evens out. So, uh, so $5 for that and it sold for $10. So that's all the sales that I have so far today. I don't know that I'll get any more this evening. Um, but if I do, I'll show them tomorrow. I hope everybody else is having a great week and that you're warmer than I am. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Welcome back, y'all. Nancy from Nancy's Notions, and I have another What's Old clip for you. It is Wednesday, December the 13th, and I have two sales today, uh, one on Etsy and one on eBay. It was pretty slow day today, but that's fine. Had a pretty busy day at my day job, so <laughs> I'm not real energetic uh, to get these so I'm glad I didn't have a lot of orders today. Hopefully it'll pick back up tomorrow. Let's take a look. On eBay, we sold this Pier 1 uh, Sanctuary. And I bought a set of these um, a while back. Well, it wasn't a full set. Just a couple of different size plates. And then three bowls, I think it was. So this is the second one of the bowls that I've sold. It sold for $15. And I think I paid about $1.50 for it. And then our Etsy sale is this Buddy L Superdog truck. And it's in pretty rough shape. I bought it at a church sale for $8, which was too much for its uh, condition. But it was something that I didn't know anything about. So it was an $8 lesson. Um, it sold for $15 on Etsy. And both of these are plus shipping. All right, that's all I've got uh, going out today i'm going to get these packed up and then um i'm going to get these packed up and then i do have a little haul uh from 
We went to uh, a little church, church thrift store. This was a couple of weekends ago. So I can show you what I got there. And then I also picked up some things at um, the Samaritan Center last weekend. Uh, I've gotten, I've, I'm behind on these and I've gotten kind of confused. I'm going to show you some stuff that I bought. <laughs> I'm going to try to remember where I bought it from. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, so maybe I didn't have, I, I think I've done all of the hauls that there was more. But I think that this is the end of the new stuff that I have that I haven't filmed yet and I haven't processed through yet and it's this is from a variety of places uh, I picked up these two vision corning wear visions this is uh, like a cranberry color and there's a little saucepan with a lid and then this is like a it's like a shallow skillet but it's very small I mean it's it's not big at all you could fry one egg in there um, but they have the Teflon coated bottom, and both of these are in really good shape. That's just some dust in there. And I paid $2.99 for the saucepan and $1.99 for the tiny skillet. Um, I did look these up briefly, but I don't remember what the price is right now. The same time that I got those, I picked up... I do have a photograph. I'll put up a screenshot of them all sitting out. Because I did go through these. Um, they are Italian nativity figures. A couple of them I can verify are Fontanini because they have the little spider mark on them. Um, but the other one, most of the other ones are like, um, they're, they're kind of like a plaster. Like inside is this uh, very stiff feels like cardboard but I guess it is plaster backing and then they're all painted they are in not terrible condition but most of the bases have some flaking paint um, but there's a cow and a donkey and a couple of camels and some shepherds uh, we do have Mary and Joseph and the baby Jesus three kings and some sheep so like I said I'll and I paid uh $4.99 for all of these pieces and I think that they'll price about six dollars a piece I'm gonna try selling them separately and if I still have them mid-February then I may just lot them up all together so, uh, so I got those the pots and the nativity uh, at the little church uh, local church thrift store and then at uh, Goodwill I picked up these two uh, silhouette pictures and they are pretty old you can just tell by the back and it was $7.99 for the pair and then at the restore I picked up this little vintage uh, lampshade it might have been a dollar and 17 of these ideals books um, like there's some Easter issues And uh, here's a Valentine and a Christmas and a Thanksgiving. You get the idea. And there are 17 of those and they were a quarter a piece. And then the last thing that I have, um, I bought a couple of things from um, ADH Dave on his last storage unit uh, eight hour marathon. <laughs> Um, I got, I don't, I don't think these are worth anything. What I really wanted was the Topsy Turvy, uh, Cinderella, not Cinderella, Snow White. She is missing all of her dwarves. Um, but then the other side is the Wicked Stepmother with her poison apple. And I paid $7 for, for these three. And then I got... These uh, new old stock, this is Mickey, or Mickey Mouse, Mighty Mouse and Heckle and Jekyll. They are puzzles, just little round puzzles, probably maybe six pieces each. And they're still in the package. And then I got this little, it's either Heckle or Jekyll, one of the two, and a little boat. 
And that is also new in the package. Uh, new Terry Tunes Travelers. And I'm not sure what I paid for those. Oh, I think I might have paid $21 for those. I don't know. That might have been my whole total. This packing slip is not very informative. <laughs> so that's all that I have to show you at the moment. Uh, I hope everybody else is having a great week. We've made it to Wednesday. Downhill slide. <laughs> On our way to Friday. Um, again, hope everybody else is having a great week. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Welcome back, y'all. Nancy from Nancy's Notions, and I've got another What's Sold clip for you. It is Thursday, December the 14th, and I have five sales today, one on Macari and four on eBay. Let's take a look. Our Macari sale is this set of three uh, Biddy Boomers. They're uh, Star Wars, Mandalorian, Bluetooth speakers. And I bought these for myself and then never used them, so... I sold them, I bought them for $20 and I sold them for $25 with free shipping, just a wash, but <laughs> they are not in my way anymore. And then on eBay, we sold this um, MW Bonsal uh, Sad Puppy Pick. <laughs> it's a print and um, it's a fairly famous print and I've had it for a very long time. And I paid $3 for it, and it sold for $32.28. Way back in the day, when I first started listing things, the numbers were random. There was no rhyme or reason as to the cents that I put on things. So it's been listed at that price for probably two years. After that, I went to $0.99, cents, you know, whatever the $24.99 or $14.99. Anyway, everything ended in $0.99. Cents. And then I got tired of that. So now I just do a flat price, $25, $24. And then um, when I do a, a batch of end and sell similar, I will reduce the price by one penny. So now I know if something ends in $0.99, I have relisted it one time. If it ends in 98, I relisted it two times, so on and so forth. So, I digress. Our second um, eBay sale is this uh, late, late 20th century art book. And it has just uh, pictures and then um, some information about that particular artist and their piece of art. Uh, this is from a library. I paid 99 cents for this at Goodwill, I believe, and it sold for $16.98. So I have relisted it twice. <laughs> and then we sold this pair of um, trucking mugs. They're from Consolidated Freight. And they're not marked on the bottom, and they don't look like they were ever really used. They do have some heavy crazing, and I did course note that in the listing. I uh, got these for two dollars at an estate sale and they sold for twelve dollars and twenty five cents. And that was on a uh, offer. And then our last eBay sale is this little uh, accent lamp that is a giraffe and I paid six dollars for him at an estate sale and he sold for 25. That's all the sales that I have going out today. I hope everybody else is having a great Thursday and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Welcome back y'all. Nancy from Nancy's Notions and I have another What's Hold clip for you. It is Saturday, December the 16th and these are my Friday sales that I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna get them packed up and shipped out today so there's no delay. Hopefully if these are gifts, people will get them by Christmas. So let's take a look. Two Etsy sales, two Macari sales, and then two eBay sales. So we'll start with the um, Etsy. The first one is this little wooden, vintage wooden child's toy. And I paid 99 cents for this somewhere. I've had it for a minute, so I'm not sure where it came from. I had it listed for 14, I think, and they used a coupon. The, Etsy, I have it set up so if someone puts something in their cart, it sends them a, a reminder and a coupon after so many, um, maybe after a day. 
anyway they used the coupon so they paid twelve dollars and sixty cents plus shipping and then our second Etsy sale has two items on it the first is the Rod McEwen 1972 calendar and I paid two dollars for that at a estate sale and then this lot of three black glass uh, ashtrays and they're from uh, Las Vegas casinos and I paid a dollar a piece for those and the two items together sold for $40 uh, and that gets them free shipping and then on Mercari we sold this um, I don't know how to say dropped my note I, I don't know how to say what kind of art this is, but it is like scissor cuts is what it means. And this one is signed by the artist and frame or matted. I paid $3 for that and it sold for 21 plus shipping. And our other Macari sale is this uh, little CD and booklet set. It doesn't have the stickers, which I did disclose. I don't know where I got this from. I paid 50 cents for it and it sold for $10. And then on eBay, we sold um, one of these uh, milk glass holly. This one, it's kind of a bowl. So it could be used for like berries, maybe, I guess. And I paid, I bought like an incomplete set of these. So I've just been selling them individually. I paid 15 cents for this and it sold for $7. And then um, also had one local pickup sale, which I met her yesterday, and I'll put up a screenshot. It's a, a Farm Bureau insurance uh, Tennessee uh, hat, like a snapback baseball top cap, and that sold for $10, and I think I paid either a quarter or 50 cents for it at a yard sale. So that's all the sales that I have so far this morning. I'm going to go ahead and get these packed up and dropped off while I'm running my errands. Hope everybody else is having a great weekend, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. One more order come in while I was packing those up, and it's this Fitz and Floyd little entwined swans ceramic basket or like a little candy dish. There is the bottom. I'm not sure what I paid for this. I'll put it on the screen. Um, but it sold for $20 plus the buyer paid for priority shipping. So we're going to get that packed up too. Welcome back, y'all. Nancy from Nancy's Notions on a rainy Sunday, December the 17th. And I have a what sold clip for you. We've got sales on eBay and Macari. Um, all of these are from yesterday afternoon and then uh, one from today. So let's take a look. All right, I'll start with our Macari sales. Um, we sold this children's stories of the Bible. It's in not, uh, it's not in the best condition, but the the cover is not. The inside is in good condition. Um, I paid a dollar for it, and it sold for ten with media mail shipping. And then we sold this uh, Zondervan uh, pink cover. Bible. I paid a dollar for it and it sold for 15 plus media mail shipping. And then our eBay sales um, sold this West Bend bean pot and it's just the pot. It's not the stand or anything, but it is in very nice condition. Um, it didn't sell for as much as I hoped. I paid five dollars for it at a yard sale and it sold for ten dollars plus shipping or ten dollars and twenty cents. And then we sold the brass, the pair of brass doves that we picked up at the flea market a while back. We paid $7.50 for those, and they sold for $25.50. One of our little nativity figures, this is one of the um, Fontanini figures, and uh, I paid $0.31 cents a piece for them. It was $4.99 for the whole bunch, so I just divided by how many I had, and he sold for $5 plus shipping. And then we have these two 
CDs, the CD set volume one and volume two uh, from hip to hop. And these are no buy cost. Uh, this was in a huge lot of CDs that was given to us. And they sold for $10 plus shipping. And then another piece of the uh, Christmas Magic Toy State train set. Uh, this is the coal car. It does take batteries and plays music. And I paid about a dollar for this and it sold for $19.99. And then we have a Jim Shore uh, Christmas ornament. It's an African-American Santa, arms full of gifts. And I paid $3 for this at a yard sale. I don't know, early, oh, back in the spring, I guess. And um, I'm sorry, I paid $2 for him at a yard sale and he sold for $22. And then our little wood pelican uh, that we got at a thrift store a few weeks back, I paid $2.73 for him and he sold for $10 plus shipping. And then our last sale is this um, cast iron owl. I guess it could be like a letter holder and you can either hang him or he sits quite nice by himself. And I paid $3 for him and he sold for $25.48. I think I sent out an offer. Um, and I've had him quite a while. I think I got him at a thrift store. All right, that's all the sales that I have going out so far today. Um, I did break my own rule and have been shopping, so I'll try to put uh, a legitimate haul in here <laughs> um, at some point. I've been to both, um, where did I go? I've been to the Goodwill a couple of times and did I go to, oh, I went to an antique store that's not too far from us, and I always see the sign for it, and so I finally went there yesterday and found some good things, so we'll take a look at those later on in this video. Hope everybody else is having a great weekend, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Well, while I was packing those orders up, I had one more on Poshmark, and it's these uh, plastic Home Co. Owls, and I paid $2 for these at a yard sale, and they sold for $18. Welcome back, y'all. Nancy from Nancy's Notions. Yes, I'm in my hoodie again. It is, once again, cold in Southeast Tennessee. <laughs> Actually, it's windy. It's very windy outside. Um, I have another What's Old clip for you. It is Monday, December the 18th. Coming down to it, y'all. Um, and I have... Well, I had four sales today. One I packed up at lunch and sent it out because they did overnight. So I'll just put up a screenshot of that one, but let's take a look at the others. Oh, well, I guess I could tell you about it. Uh, from the nativity figures that I have, I sold the baby Jesus uh, on Etsy for $10, but they paid $30 for overnight shipping to Texas. So I shipped it out at lunchtime. Okay, um, we do have another Etsy sale, and it is this pair of license plates, and they sold for $30 plus shipping, regular shipping. On Macari, uh, sold a, a bundle deal, these, these three nativity figures, the camel um, and two shepherds, and they were $6 a piece, so $18 plus shipping. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> math and then a bonanza sale uh this super mario it's a blind bag something i don't know it was on the clearance uh aisle at walmart but i, I shouldn't have bought it there was only one if there would have been more than one i might have done better um but i paid six dollars for it and it sold for seven dollars and 85 cents on Bonanza. They did pay $10.85 for priority shipping, and I think they'll only charge me like $7.50 or $7.85, so I might make a little off the shipping, so it's not a total loss. And their fees are a lot less, so eh, <laughs> whatever. 
Um, I hope everybody else is having a great week so far. It's only Monday. Um, uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Well, I'm going to do my outro here um, and end the video. I apologize. I didn't get any of my new hauls into this episode. Uh, time just ran out on me. There was too much to do in too little time. So I hope that everyone has a Merry Christmas and um, you get to spend it with family and loved ones. And we'll see you next Thursday with another video. Thanks for watching. And we'll see ya. Bye-bye.